clothes performance of black soldier fly lava fed on cow mano. And as we said from our previous video, we are going to update the growth performance of BSF larvae on cow mano. Here is the results after 10 days. Here is the results. Due to the moisture, we said we have to aerate our cow mano with materials dry materials here is cow mano related with cassava peel as you can see this is the growth of bsf lava of cow mano irritated with cassava peel as you can see now this is the one this is the growth of the one irritated with rice we rated our cow mano, this one, with rice husk. This is the performance. This is the performance after 10 days. Now here is the third one of we rated cow mano with sawdust. As you can see, this is the performance this is the performance our recommendation using cow manure only as a source crate for BSF lava in terms of growth and performance is no 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 if we want to use cow manure in order to use our waste to feed our lava it is advisable to mix it with other ingredients maybe 50 at 50 50 or 60 40 but feeding bsf lava on only cow manure, the result is not that encouraging. The result is not that encouraging due to the fact that we rate it with sawdust. As you can see, this is the result. We have some that are still in instant two, some that are still in instant one, some are big lava. The growth is not that encouraging. If we must use cow manure, it is advisable to mix it with other material. This is what we want to do now. We are going to mix this with other materials, other proteins and uh, energy-based sunscreens in order to hasten their growth before they start turning to pre pooper let it start on it to pre pooper this is the good performance of bsm lavi on 100% cow manure and you control the moisture of this with sawdust here the moisture is controlled with rice husk there is a little bit improvement in terms of the growth maybe due to the rice husk as you can see though we still have some that are still in instant 3, instant 2, some are in instant 4 this is the size of cow manure irritated with rice husk as you can see this is the one irritated with the cassava pea this one give us at least some level of high level of growth compared to the other one, maybe due to the uh, cassava peel. The cassava peel is, uh, is rich in energy.
that one up in terms of their goods. Aside that, we still have some that are still in instant three, some are instant two, some instant four. The growth rate is not, or uh, the uniformity is very, very poor. It's poor compared to other subscripts we have used. As you can see, that's why we advise you mixing it with other subscripts if we want to feed our BSF lava with cow manure. That is our result. Thank you once again, and you're welcome. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more informative and educative video on this black soldier fly lava. Thank you once again, and you.